Hey, my good friend, Sam Haymart with Test Driven TV. Recently, we test drove the 2022 Mercedes-Benz C300 with the M254 four-cylinder turbocharged engine. And so we've done a full underhood tour and a technical overview of this engine. And that is what's coming up. The 2022 to present Mercedes-Benz W206 C-Class we tested features likely one of the most advanced turbocharged four-cylinder engines in the world, with technologies and refinement that make it truly fitting for the luxury car in which it's found. The 2.0-liter gasoline engine, codenamed M254, is hidden beneath a litany of covering panels, several layers deep, both for dress-up as well as sound and thermal functionality. Once the many cover pieces are all off, we can now get a better view of this engine's secrets. Top level output numbers are 255 horsepower and 295 pound-feet of torque in North America. It has a 9-speed automatic transmission with an integrated 20 horsepower starter generator system known as ISG. That's part of a 48-volt mild hybrid system Mercedes-Benz calls EQBoost. The ISG performs multiple functions, starting the engine, providing extra torque for acceleration, maintaining a coast with the engine turned off, and generating power for the high voltage battery that makes it all happen. The M254 belongs to the same engine family of the 3 liter M256 six cylinder. A special feature of the engines is a 48 volt electric air compressor that provides additional boost pressure ahead of the double scroll turbocharger at low speeds before the exhaust gases get the turbocharger spinning. This effectively eliminates turbo lag and provides a flat power curve that most turbocharged engines lack. It also features an overboost function that allows maximum power to be increased by 27 horsepower for up to 30 seconds under full acceleration. To try and follow it all, the air intake charge starts at the front of the engine bay and draws in through an air filter box that has the engine control unit or ECU packaged on top. Air is then drawn around the rear of the engine and into the double scroll turbocharger. Parallel to this, a 48 volt Borgen Warner electric compressor mounted low on the driver's side of the engine also draws air in from the air filter box and sends boosted air into the intake charge ahead of the turbocharger intake at variable levels depending on conditions. Boosted air from both sources then makes its way back around the rear of the engine to an air to water intercooler and into the combustion chambers through an integral intake manifold. Once inside the combustion chambers, the process features the Mercedes-Benz Camtronic system which allows for variable valve lift with a sliding camshaft with different load profiles. The system also features variable cam timing and direct fuel injection for the ultimate in adjustment and tuning range for the combustion process. Once combustion is complete, exhaust exits through the turbocharger and directly into the catalyst after treatment system. Notice the extensive heat shielding at the exhaust plumbing for thermal management efficiency as well as protecting the surrounding engine bay. In that way, looking around the engine bay reveals a lot of shielding to protect from that heat. At the passenger side firewall is the 48 volt high voltage lithium ion battery for the mild hybrid system. Also notable are the cast aluminum strut towers and significant bracing structures that provide for weight savings and the ultimate in body structure rigidity. Servicing and maintaining the C300 with the M254 engine isn't something Mercedes-Benz expects most owners to do, but it is possible if you have a bit more time and expertise to bring to it. Common fluids are easily found such as the main engine coolant at the passenger side front of the engine compartment. Coolant for the intercooler circuit is found at the driver side front of the engine bay in a similarly colored and shaped reservoir. Brake fluid is checked and filled at the driver side firewall along with the windshield washer fluid reservoir close by. Ahead of both is a high level circuit breaker box, this one not usually something owners need to access. The consumer grade fuse panel can be found behind a snap off cover on the passenger side in the trunk. The 12 volt battery is also found in the trunk below the floorboard set into a well protected basin. The oil filler cap is located on the top of the engine at the front accessible with the covering on or off. There is no traditional dipstick to check the oil level. This is monitored electronically and checked through a menu on the instrument cluster. The oil filter, it's located on the top front of the engine on the driver's side for easy changing in service. but the removal of the air intake duct ahead of the filter is required to access it. 
Changing the error filter also requires additional effort and time to navigate all of its connections and bundled relationships with the engine control unit. All right, my friends, there you have it for the full underhood tour and technical overview of the M254 engine in the 2022 and later Mercedes-Benz C300, North American version, of course. Now, if you like this kind of video, you can subscribe to our TDTV Garage channel right there, or you can see the test drive of this car right there. Either way, stay tuned.